is how it all began with Jason. Good afternoon. Good no officer. Um, license and registration, please. You look familiar. Really? Wait, who's Jason, mother? Yes, Jason's yeah. my son. What part of Jason is? I don't know. You gotta be somewhere around. Well, what I can tell you, right, is that you need to talk to Jason. You really need to speak to Jason. I talked to Jason, officer. Keep encouraging Jason. I will try, but. I, I'm trying to tell him to stop, stay away for bad company, you know what's that? All right, you have a good afternoon. Thank you, officer. All right. Shots for shots! Yeah, who's that calling you? Yeah. Alright, no problem. Yeah. What's that? Are we using a quick door? Are we any PNC and you want to be playing door? I was thinking to come down along there. Can you hear you want? Yes, sir. I got a run stand by your boy. And we're not feel good about it, man. The boss wants to get something out. Jason? Nah, boy, not Jason. What am my father? They won't be before he died, brother. This is what it is, you know. Get the boss back. So the boss is going to be fresh. Nah, look, you see. Nah, listen. Man, you in or you over? Man, like, you ever try to, like, try to, try to do what? So, like, so you ain't got all the scenes you play? Oh man, you don't know how the big man is, ain't okay? You don't know how the boss is, are you in or you out? Cause you don't know if you out, you're the enemy. You want the enemy? Do you know about that? Nothing. That's how it, that's, that's how it is. You in or you out? Tell the boss again, yeah, man. You sure? After you were dead, tell the boss again. One second, yes, you know, there you are. Yeah, boss. Yeah, everything's set. Yeah, you got location? Or mm. I don't know about that. Everything will get taken care of, man. Don't, don't watch them. Yeah. Yeah, he good, he good, he good. I really like feeling like that. Stay in my eyes, I'm running, watch me. Got already here, man.
So I already know what's going on with Jay. So I'm already trying to see. Let me tell you, I guess it's lovely this evening. That's looking out with Jason. I know, I know you something else. Yes. But honestly, you're right. Jason really needs to know what he wants and he likes the triple. You ain't gonna tell me that. You see this girl is on the box. Near Lana? Mm hmm. I see he's give her all of his money. He got mad. I ain't talking to you this evening. You don't got words. You don't got words. You hear? You need to talk to him for real. I will do that just for you, man. Because you know something? The police had him in custody the other day. But he ain't tell me that? No, he ain't tell you, but that's what, that's what going on with Jason. All of that foolishness. Mm. You need to talk to him for true. I can do that for you. At the time, the man here playing Damon was better. Oh, yeah, so he meant to get gambling. Yeah, uh, watch me up. Be with business. He got the money, right? He got the money, right? He got the master. He got the money, right? You know what you think? Yeah, I don't know what to do. Your bullets start beating. I don't know what to do. Work it out. Make business stop on the one player. Feelings, yeah. He got feelings, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> feelings of a sound of much, Jason. Oh, he like, got you, man. Now you think you're nervous, he played Domino's all, taping the directions out. Oh, man, we got you, we got you, we got you. I played before you turned to that, Jason, what are you? Wait, wait, wait. Well, let him get up. Jason, you still hang around these mates? Yeah, man. 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 Yes, I don't. I keep telling you, I tell 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 you, I Jason, where are you? I need more money. This is Jason. You? This is so hard for call. real. Message and I will get right back to you. Jason, please bring money for me. Please, later today. I done with you for real. Listen, don't worry about him. You working? You need to find a job. Life is short. Eternity is long, lady. Oh, lady, mind your business. Okay, you. Oh, you are coming here to me. Oh, what? Sweet mommy, come to that church tonight. Oh, I got you then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, you are Good afternoon, I'm Cindy Charles and this is GCP News. We begin with breaking news as there was a fatal shooting yesterday in yeah. here with St. Peter oh, around 10.30 this here, man. morning. Well, man, this brings to 40 the number of homicide for the year so far. Oh, well, it follows sister. yesterday That's afternoon really good, in Bayfield St. Philip where mm -hmm. one person was reported dead and five others wounded amidst a spate of gun violence violence across the nations. Let's hear what the people have to say about these shootings. 
I honestly would like the youth to put down the guns, think about the next person and the families that they actually have an impact on. Um, definitely the need to find another way to resolve any issues and find some confidence within themselves because this thing where they think that they need to shoot another person or show up that this is them is a bad John or whatever the case may be is so not manly. So then definitely needs to find another way to resolve any issues. Well, I think the young people is going down a wrong path and a wrong direction. You know, the word of God says broad is the way that leads to destruction. And there are many young people that are going down the wrong path in the wrong direction. Many of them lack proper guidance and proper direction in their lives. And many are being led astray. Many are following a wrong course and a wrong path. You know, but I believe that we need to continue to pray for our young people. You know, that whatever spirit is influencing their lives, that they will get back to God and that they will pray and that their parents and other people will be able to encourage them to serve God and to go to church and to get to know the things of God in their lives. You know, so that is what I feel um, concerning what is going on in this nation, you know, that they need to follow the right path and, and they need to go in the path that leads to, you know, the right direction and they need to serve God. We can look at a country like El Salvador who, you know, was rampant with, with crime and violence mm -hmm. and the president of El Salvador had no, um, you know, call a prayer and fast in the country and he got his entire cabinet together and they went into praying and fasting and asking God to heal this land, you know, and uh, the entire country is now miraculously changed. Actually, the crime of violence is down, according to saying 98%, I understand, you know, according to saying. As a parent, I'm very concerned about the violence that is going on in this country. You know, the youths are not being guided properly from a young age. Children are being led astray. From the age of five, you can see children moving around and they're shooting at each other, making gestures, you know. And as a parent, I'm concerned for my children every day when they leave to go to school. I don't know if they'll be coming back, you know. So I would like that someone, someone will, will put something in place to deal with these youth and the gun violence in this country. When we look at our society and you see what is happening with our young people, you know, sometimes you wonder, they do remember that they have choices. And the mere fact that what they do or what they entertain will determine their responses. So many negative videos, games, shooting, killing, the music. You will be amazed to listen to songs and find out it's okay to kill someone that they don't like. And yet we wonder why they turn to violence. You are what you watch. You become what you listen to. You have to make the right choice. Just as I am without one thing. gather here this afternoon to lay to rest my dearly departed nephew Jason affectionately known as Jay when the events that claimed his life happened I was at the salon and I heard the news extract and it was the shooting occurred where I know my nephew usually limes and plays dominoes. And I knew within myself all was not right. Only to later hear that my nephew was gone. Mm. <laughs> Jason, he was not, he was not always the best child. But I challenged him to do better. And the last conversation that we had, Jay promised me that he would make me and his mother proud of him. 
He accepted Jesus into his life. My nephew, right before his passing. And I challenge all of you this evening to seek Christ while he can be found. You have the prime opportunity available to you to grab hold of the outstretched arm of God. He, there's no sin, there's no burden that he will refuse to carry for you. Once you invite him into your heart, he will come. Is there anyone, is there anyone who's willing to accept the gift of salvation? Is there anyone who's willing to accept Jesus Christ into their life today? Come forward, young man. Come forward. Jesus as your Lord and Savior. Yes. If you are darling, know that you are forgiven. Know that you are forgiven. Blood running down the street. Where families and friends gather to weep. Well, the youth, them out there on the run. Praying to Jah that they never had a gun. But the peer pressure bittersweet. Now they left you alone just to roam the street. So put down the gun, I tie up, put down the gun. Put down the gun, I tie up, put down the gun. Living that life now can't be fun. You're living your life now. On the run, look over your shoulder all day long. Your mother, your brother, all of them gone.